previously on Minecraft Story. It is said that within every loss, every challenge, Lucas, and every failure, there is a gift. When revered heroes are lost, we find new ones in our friends. When faced with a mind-bending problem, we find a way to rise to the occasion. And when our band of unlikely adventurers are tasked with saving the world from the coming <gasps> storm, they will bring together the bravest and the brightest to stop it. But finding the last and most elusive member of the Order of the Stone and his legendary Formidabomb would prove their most perilous mission yet. For some would rather our hero's story end here. Shutting the door on their adventure forever. But like all doors, when one closes, another is bound to open. Weird. Definitely. Everything feels really fast now. I said that really fast, didn't I? Ugh. I'm getting dizzy. We need to find Soren. Yeah. I still can't figure out how Ivor made the door close. Maybe we should focus more on how it opens. That's basically what I said. Guys. Sure. Maybe it was a pressure plate. See, How did Ivor manage to beat you? Like he got one over on all of us. Yeah, but he used a potion for that. He beat you fair and square. Fair and square? Look at this. I'm not trying to freak you out, but I'm a little bit freaked out right now. It's starting to feel stiff. And my vision's all jittery. We have to tell the others. This isn't a we thing. Yes, it is. We're a team, and they all deserve to know. Maybe. Look, I'll, I'll tell them. Eventually. You have to. It's just gonna cause panic, and we can't afford that right now. If it becomes more of a thing, I'll tell everyone. But let me do it. Hey guys, I have an idea. Okay. Magnus, help! Well, all right, but I have another idea. Is it yelling for Eligard? Well, not anymore. Look, they aren't coming back. We have no idea where they are. No need for desperation. As long as we have... This! Flint and steel? I don't get it. it. It's not... That's not what I meant to pull out. Hold on. Uh, oh, this! 
Looks like it might be broken. Here, let me see it. Maybe you're just holding it wrong. Or maybe you just have to jiggle it a little. Do you mind? I just want to see it. You can see it without touching. Not if you can't get it to work. It's working fine. Oh! Soren! Find him, Jesse. Maybe he can help us. Ready to dig, people. Who knows how far down that goes? We might end up digging until we hit bedrock. Guys, we're not really equipped for this. Yeah, good point. Let's sit here and sing songs instead. First song is called How We Gave Up at the Finish Line Because of Lucas. Raise your hands if you've got the hands. What are you talking about? Hi, go! Let's get to it, then. It's a hole! Does that mean we're cool? Uh, I'll find out! I guess that makes sense. You dig, you get a hole. Ooh, that would have been bad. Hey guys, get a move on! <sighs> Everyone okay? I just slipped. What's that smell? Just breathe through your mouth. Axel already does that. Hey. Let's get out of here. Stay close, boy. here you don't understand this is a grinder they're meant to kill monsters trouble is they can't tell the difference between monsters and people what's a grinder doing down here not just any grinder this is the craziest one I've ever seen it has to be Soren's Oh, 
creepers! Jump? You're going to jump, aren't you? The jumping is the easy part, it's the landing that's hard. For more? Jesse! Hey, ugly! Watch out! Hey, Bonehead! I'm talking to you! Any time now, Jesse! Help the others! 
Water was supposed to break a fall. Uh, is everyone okay? We all good? Well, I am definitely not thirsty anymore. <sighs> We're fine. <clears throat> no, no, don't worry. I'm totally fine. Why? Oh, crap. I'm sorry. What's with you, Jesse? You go after that stupid trinket over your friends? You're letting all this get to your head. And you're forgetting what's important. We'd be lost without the amulet. Listen to what you're saying. Axel and Reuben could have died up there. You're lucky. But they didn't. If we don't stick together, none of this means anything. Hey, buddy. It's all right. <laughs> Lucas, we might have had our differences, but you're all right in my book. Thanks, Axel. No, thank you. I'm gonna go look around. I really appreciate you helping Reuben back there, Lucas. Huh. I guess I did. You don't have to do it all yourself, you know. I could help. Like I said, thanks. Jesse? What? The amulet. Soren must be close. Uh, uh, where'd he go? You have got to be kidding me. Sounds like the grinder is backed up. With loot? <gasps> go, 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 go! Monsters. Holy crap. An end portal? That's the way out. Wait! What? Look! <clears throat> oh no! Petra! Get away from them! Yeah! Yeah! In your face, monsters! 
think I'm starting to get the hang of this. Here we go. Jump! Just keeps getting better. Where's Axel? He was right behind me. Ooh. I swear, I'm not trying to do that. Get off! Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Oh, I, I... There, there, Lucas. It's okay. Let it all out. What? No, I'm not crying, just look! Hide. So, uh... What do we call that? A, a herd of Endermen? A, a flock of Endermen? A swarm? It's a haunting of Endermen. We might want to hold off on the grammar lessons until later. Which way are we headed, Jesse? Stuff like that doesn't work in the Nether. Probably not the end, either. <laughs> ah, great! Whew. Man, so we were trapped, and now we're lost. So, we go from uh, a death machine that almost drowns us, and we land here, in the end. <laughs> Which is the right name for it, since now, incredibly, we don't even know where we're going. At least we're alive, and well. Yeah. We just have to keep on trucking till we get to Soren. <sighs> Face it, Jesse. We might never find this guy. There he is. Did that just happen? I can't believe that just happened. A am I the only one that's surprised? Because that was... I mean, that was like we conjured him. That has to be Soren. Who else would build a staircase in the end? That's got to be him. We gotta go. Everyone, follow me. I'll get us to the other side! Just stay behind me, and we'll... <coughs> we'll be fine! No, it's alright. I'll go first. Actually, you know what? I'll just go. a chance. Just say the word, and I'll do it. Everyone, follow Lucas, and let's pick up the pace, okay? Come on! Nice moves back there, Lucas. <laughs> Thanks. And you too, Jesse. Thanks for giving me a shot. Let's go. That someday I love something as much as Soren seems to love stairs. Jesse, can you give me a sec? Real quick. Need a hand? Oh, no. <coughs> I can manage. Thanks. Really, I'm fine. I'm good, I'm good. We can keep moving. Oh, so many stairs. There's a ladder. 
Better not be a long one. Whatever this is, looks like that's the way in. After you, dude. Here it goes. What do you see? Please don't say more stairs. It's the most beautiful place I've ever seen. Ah, so bright. That's my body, Axel. My broken, battered Wait body. A second. The ground is almost. This squishy. doesn't look like a normal like carpet. Tree. Looks funny too. Hey, I can see it again. Glad to hear it. Now, can you please get off me? Sorry, dude. What in the? It's made of wool. This tree, the grass. It's, it's all wool. You're telling me that we've been resting all our hopes on this guy, and the whole time he's been building some totally artificial happy land? Well, it's real wool. It's real evidence that Soren is whacked. Could it be that he just missed home? If you miss home, you go and visit. You don't build an exact replica. We came here for nothing. What are we even supposed to do now? We came here for Soren and for his Formidabomb. That's still the plan. Just look around, Jesse. If the greatest builder of all time has spent years working on this, what are the chances he's even gonna have that bomb, huh? I've had enough crazy for one day. What's his problem? He seems pretty upset. Maybe he's allergic to wool. Just give him some space. He'll be okay. Hey, Petra. So, on a scale of uh to uh, how bad are you feeling? Somewhere in between, but I'm holding on for now. How do you think Soren managed to get out of here without leaving any clues behind? He is the greatest builder of all time. If anybody knew how to put in the secretest of secret doors, it's him. So I'm probably looking for... Well, to open a secret door, you need a secret mechanism. Have you ever seen anything weirder than this place? Actually, yeah. I once saw a villager dig a huge trench and fill it with, like, a million carrots. I guess I'm gonna keep looking around. Look away. Neat! Looks kind of like clouds made out of glass. Sounds like the music is coming through the wall. Cool. 
Cool. Thought you could trick me, huh, fake son? Well, it's not gonna work. What's up, Jesse? Either of you guys know what's eating Lucas? Well, as a longtime observer of human behavior... We have no idea. Try, you know, talking to him. You both doing okay? Could be worse. Could be better. I think I'm onto something with this lever puzzle. If I can just find the secret door, I know it's gonna open. I'm gonna keep poking around. Right. Well, at least that's not made of wool. Must be all sorts of hidden water systems in this place. I'll be back. I'll be here. It's, uh, cute, I guess. What do you want? Petra's worried about you. Listen, I know I've been prickly, okay? But, Jesse, I think something's wrong with Petra. I mean, you have to have noticed. The lack of energy, the labored breathing. I, I wish I could tell you, but I'm not supposed to talk about it. Wait, talk about what? Jesse, if I'm right about this, you have to tell me. It's not fooling anybody. At least not me. Lucas, Petra's sick. How long have you known? A while, but she asked me not to say anything. The wither infected her with something. So everything I was worried about is true. This is my fault, Jesse. Petra's wither sickness, it's because of me. There's no way this is because of you. If I hadn't choked, you would have been able to pull Petra out of that tractor beam sooner. For all we know, Petra didn't get sick until way after that. Maybe you're right. If one of our best fighters is sick... Do we even stand a chance anymore? Not like we haven't dealt with some grade A problems before, but... I just can't help feeling kind of... hopeless. If we stick together, we can do anything. Even something that feels impossible. It just feels... extra impossible now. Then we stick together extra hard. Okay. I just kind of wish Petra would tell everybody. It would just make things... easier. Hey, Reuben. Hey, Jesse.
You haven't found a way out of here, have you? Honestly, I haven't even been looking. I just... I just need a little alone time right now. How are you holding up? I'm not the one you need to worry about. Uh, I kind of need to get at that lever you're blocking. Thanks. Yep. That's... weird. Hey everyone, I think I found Soren's way out! Way to go, Jesse! That's awesome! Nice sleuthing, Jesse. Sorry I wasn't more help back there. But when I think back to how I ran all over Endercon looking for Ivor, or when I got that skull. Don't even worry about it, Petra, and don't apologize. I... uh... thanks. We'll check out the rest of the house. See if we can find Soren before he finds us. Guess the water system isn't just for the outside. Not that the outside was actually the outside. You could fit hundreds of people in here, but it doesn't look like it's being used for much of anything. See what's going on behind this door. Position to celebrate my newest discovery. That's him. This time, I observe Soren place a block on top of another block. <laughs> what the? Rudimentary, yes, but it's just a, a recording. Of undeniable intelligence. <laughs> I hope I'm not imagining things. <laughs> After know. all that, <laughs> he's not even here. <laughs> I, 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 I better eat something. I'm positively lightheaded with excitement. We came all this way, and for what? We're no closer to Soren than before. Well, this record didn't turn on by itself. Huh, good point. I guess he really likes the sound of his own voice then. Maybe there's something useful well, on this record. Our next step we can is figure to out what he's whether talking they might be about. able to be persuaded to build collaboratively. Hmm. I've worked up a simple set of building instructions to inspire them. I will disguise myself and hide among them in order to observe them more closely. Huh. Hmm. Oh, hide among them. Hide among who? Uh, Jesse? Do you think Soren is talking about them? <laughs> Then again, everything else about this guy has been pointing to crazy. But even if you could, why would you want to? You think he's actually training Enderman to build stuff? I think he thinks he's training Enderman to build stuff. 
Let's look around, see what we could find out. Totemic constructions of peaceful Endermen. Hmm. Could Endermen be implored to work together? Or are they like sheep and pigs, wandering randomly and doing things based on whim rather than higher thought processes? I've already decided that only Endermen at peace build structures. When it's agitated, hard to get plants to grow in the end. Don't have any interest in building things, only hitting me with their fists. Repeatedly. Meanwhile, peaceful Endermen will move blocks from place to place, on and on, seemingly ad infinitum, until they somehow achieve satisfaction and teleport away. Clearly, this will require further detailed observation. Found something. I am. What you so got? It's definitely so some sort of crafting recipe. But why would someone as brilliant as Soren need a recipe for a shape that simple? Because they're not for Soren. They're for the Endermen. This must be what he's trying to teach them to build. Those instructions called for clay blocks, just like this one. The folly of pumpkins? Wearing a pumpkin may stop the Endermen from attacking me, but I remain convinced it is also altering their behavior, as if their preternatural knowledge of my presence keeps them from take this their one true too. natures. Therefore, I have now begun to fashion a camouflage suit that will allow me to mingle amongst these heretofore inscrutable creatures, and <gasps> like a fearless explorer burning his boats to the ground upon reaching the shores of a new land. My entire cache of pumpkins has now been baked, into delicious pies. You find anything useful? <laughs> Worth asking. <laughs> Whoa, you're right. If I want to go out there, I need to put on a disguise. That's three I've grabbed so far. Enderman Observations, Part 27? I have been watching the Endermen up close today, and I'm convinced that I may have caught them communicating. Or, at the very least, two of them stood near each other for an extended period. It was very exciting. Then they wandered away. But it seemed deliberate. Maybe. I followed one of them for the next three hours. Here's what happened. Good thing they can't see me through this glass. I'll take this one too. Calls of the Ender. <clears throat> I'm no art snob, but... <clears throat> and finally, an Enderman love song. <clears throat> It's all just fascinating. Hey, Olivia. What do you think the others have found? I don't know. 
Zorn's mansion looked huge, but the lab seems to be where the real answers are. Hey, Olivia. What do you think it's like actually living in the end? At least you don't have to worry about noisy neighbors, unless you get those guys riled up. Hey, Olivia. Find anything else? Mm, nothing helpful. At least not yet. Hey, Olivia. Find anything else? Mm, nothing helpful. At least not yet. Olivia, check it out. An Enderman... suit? Either Soren's got a very unique fashion sense, or... Wait a second! This must be the disguise Soren was talking about on the recording. In order to walk amongst the Endermen, you have to become an Enderman. Oh, it smells like one, apparently. Woof! Okay, so... If Soren is using those blueprints to teach the Endermen to build, and there's a disguise missing from the stand... He must be conducting his experiment right now. Of course! The missing disguise is the one he had to put on before going outside. Which means if we want to get to Soren, oh, we have to go out there to do it. That leftover Enderman suit would fit me. Guess it's time to play dress up. Creepy. How do I look? I don't think you want my honest opinion. But it just might do the trick. Hang on a second. Soren in disguise looks like any old Enderman, and so will you. How are you going to find him? Walk up to every Enderman out there and say, Hey, are you Soren? The whole point of the disguise is to avoid that kind of attention. We just need to stand out without being seen, like a shadow in the night. What? Try not to die, okay? I'd really hate to have to watch that from behind this protective glass. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Okay, we've just got to get Soren's attention. And avoid attracting theirs. Six blocks to finish that shape in Soren's instructions. And this guy's got the only block around.
Down five to go. I just hope that Soren's watching wherever he is. That's everything I've got. Guess I gotta find another block. Cracked it yet? Not yet, but I'm getting closer. Looks like this is the last block in here. Try this again. False evidence of Enderman intelligence accomplished. Uh, nothing to see here, guys. Just walk away. Okay, they're not walking away. Definitely not walking away. I am sorry about this, but it has to look real. I I don't think it'll bruise. Your face, I mean. These suits were built with durability in mind. You must be Soren. Well, I am. But must I be? I'm not sure if I want to sometimes. Sometimes I'd prefer to be anything but Soren, like a donkey, for example. Why did you hit me? There were strategic reasons, and a personal one. You are trespassing, after all. You hit me hard in the face. You upset the Enderman, and I got you to safety. By the way, as far as introductions are concerned, this is not going very well. We're in danger. Oh, what else is new? Whatever your issue is, whatever your problem, it has occurred before, and has been solved before. Even so, what do you need me for? I've gone out of my way to avoid these types of problems. I don't even remember what it looks like up there. I need you to be a hero. Hmm, I see. And what do you think a hero would do in this situation? A hero would give me his Formidabom. Yeah. 
There's a wither storm on the loose and it's eating the world. Ah, I see. You misspoke. You don't need me. You need my stuff. I've found that when you give people what they want, they turn on you. They become resentful. They show their true colors. I won't do that. <laughs> it's only natural. It's why I prefer Endermen. They always do what you expect, almost to a fault. You're a stranger. And what you're asking for is too dangerous. I have the amulet. What? Gabriel gave it to me. Gabriel? Gabriel asked me to reassemble the Order of the Stone. The Order of the Stone? They asked for me? I've always known they needed me, but I was never sure if they wanted me. It's lonely down here without your friends. Gabriel is your friend. Hmm, I don't know. Does he ever talk about me? Uh, sure. What kinds of things do they say? Specifically? Give me an example. That you were the best of them. Well, that's very nice to hear. But what about you? Are you my friend? As long as we're on the subject? Not to put you on the spot? Not really. Uh, I get it. A joke. Between friends. That is so classic. You! Don't worry. I'm going to help you, because that's what friends do. Before we leave, I'm going to give my old friends a gift. The gift of song. Gary may seem scary, but he's a swell guy. Sally dilly dallies, give her credit she tries. They might look the same to the untrained eye. But that's yeah, a lot. Let it out. So I say... Wait, is that... Are, are, are you? Soren! Whoa! Nice to meet you, Soren. <coughs> you look terrible. Seems a bit odd. They've never been inside before. Oh, crap. <sighs> You've upset them. You've altered their behavior. Okay, let's go. And the hits just keep on coming. Huh. I wasn't expecting so many house guests. There's no way I have enough seashell soaps for all of them. How are we supposed to get out of here? We need to come up with a plan. And not our usual, we'll come up with a plan when we have to, oh wait, now we have to kind of plan. Let's break that fountain. Back in the maze, when we fell into the water, the Endermen didn't follow us. Well, naturally. Endermen hate water. Oh, if we could force the fountain to overflow somehow... Jesse, you still have the Enderman suit. Put that on, and you'll be able to safely reach the fountain. <gasps> oh, just when I thought I'd never have to smell this thing again. Good luck, dude. We'll, um... I'll watch from here, then, where it's safe. <gasps> Phew. Try not to die. Come on, 
Guys, it's clear! Oh, no. We're gonna die. Ah! Nobody's gonna die because I'm going to break that other fountain. Okay, everybody, let's go! Ah. What's the hold up? <gasps> They're everywhere. How are we supposed to get through this? I mean, physically and psychologically. I'm wearing the Enderman suit, so I'll go first. Just grab on to me. I guess if this is the only way we're gonna make it back to the trap door. about how flammable my building material was. So I installed a fire suppression system to prevent the whole thing from going up in flames. So there's more water? Much more. If we activate it, it could disperse all these Endermen while we swim to safety. Can we reach the controls from here? The lever. It's right up there. Yeesh. I don't know how much water this thing is going to kick out, so everybody... It's working! Well done, Jesse. Now, time to swim to that trap door. Quick, come on.
We made it. Making it is relative. Oh, come on! Problem, I mean, sleep. This will be the. I haven't actually built it yet. That's a small problem? You seem like a person who appreciates cool stuff that's cool for no reason. Hey? Go ahead and throw that lever behind you. Jesse! Hold on to your socks, because they're about to get blown off. Go to work, boys. Attack us, will they? Ask me no questions, and I'll tell you no lies. That didn't actually... Ask me no questions! Do you guys hear that? The what? All that stuff whispering. Take me, take me now. I think it's saying... Olivia should get to take more than Axel. But why? Because she's cooler. Nah, uh, come on, Loot. I thought you and me were tight. Wouldn't hurt to take a few things. And by few, you mean all, right? I'll just fetch the Super TNT. It's right up there. How are you gonna get up there? Oh, I have my ways. Oh, and feel free to help yourselves. Just make sure you keep an eye out for the gunpowder we'll need to make that formidable. I mean, it would be really handy to have glowstone dust. But it would be so cool to finally have my very own spider eye. Big decision? I'll leave you to it. What? Honestly, I'm wearing what right now? All this power went straight to my head. And then I got a head rush. And now I'm too overwhelmed to take anything. Stay strong, Axel. I'll try. See anything you want, Reuben? <laughs> Just because everyone else is grabbing stuff doesn't mean you have to, too. You both doing okay? It's gotten really bad. Part of me is hoping that when we bomb the wither storm, the sickness will just dissipate. Sure would be nice, huh? Well, it makes sense, doesn't it? I had the same thought. Well, fingers crossed, right? Toes too. Soren? Jesse! 
think I've got almost enough gunpowder now. Glad to hear it. And Jesse, I am sorry for not keeping this place as organized as I should. It's very embarrassing. And this is my Super TNT. Wait, but I thought Super TNT was the formidable. Uh, of course not. They're two completely different words, aren't they? So what is Super TNT exactly? Well, it's just another one of my marvelous impossible objects. If it's impossible, how do you make it in the first place? Hmm. Remember, Jesse, I killed the Ender Dragon. <laughs> I do impossible things every day. Do we just combine this with gunpowder? Well, the crafting recipe is quite simple, really. Super TNT in the middle, and gunpowder all around. Got it. No, 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 no. The ingredients are highly unstable. Even putting them in close proximity to each other is a risk. Okay, well, we may not have the Formidabomb yet, but at least we finally have the ingredients to build one. Progress. And now that we have them, we... <clears throat> we... I literally don't remember. You're gonna have to help me out a little, Jesse. Looking for any information here? Now we just need to find a way to get it inside the Witherstorm to blow it up. Oh, oh dear. Oh, I was afraid of this. With the end underwater, the Endermen will try to escape. Maybe we should leave when any of them show up. Of course. Of course! To the minecarts, everyone! <laughs> I've been waiting ages to say that. To people, I mean. Incoming! Oh, there you are! So glad you could make it! Ha! I could have used you earlier! <laughs> Showing up just in time to hold up the trophy, huh? Why did you leave us? Leave? Ha! <laughs> We're right here! You ditched us! Uh, we've been fighting this entire time! Uh, what's going on? Uh... You don't have to worry about the monsters! They're running away! Worry about what they're running away from. I feel like that got bigger. It did. Let's do this. Sora? It's him! It's you! Hello, old friends. No! It's time to go! We only get one shot at this. Remember, once the Formida Bomb is crafted, It'll explode in a matter of seconds. It means whoever is doing the crafting will be in great danger. I was hoping, well, perhaps we could draw straws. <laughs> Don't look at me. I think I made a tweak an ankle earlier, so. This is my chance to step up. Perhaps. to set off the Formidabomb. That's what I was hoping for. The rest of us will build distractions in its path. Hopefully it will buy you some time. <coughs> you should be ashamed of yourselves. Jesse, take my armor. It will help. Eh, you can take mine got me out of a lot of jams. I insist. I double insist. I triple insist. I 
insist four times. Quadruple! Know it all. <laughs> I've never found that insulting. <laughs> I bet you don't know what the fifth one is, though. Quintuple. Alternatively, pentuple. Right on, Jesse! Uh, by the power vested in me, yada da yada da yada da, the Order of the Stone! What? Jesse, you're going to have to set down a crafting table out there and make that formidable. Everyone else, grab a buddy and split up. We need to keep that wither storm on track, so build, build, build! Jesse, don't forget, Super TNT in the middle! And gunpowder all around! Jesse, you actually did it! Not that I'm saying I doubted you, but I did a little. But now I don't, and I never will again. Look, I know it wasn't easy, but... About time we got a real win. I couldn't have done this without you guys. Any of it. Oh, believe me, we're well aware. Thanks for saying it, though. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. Uh, anybody seen Soren and Magnus? Oh, no. You fought valiantly, my friend. <clears throat> we both know my fight is over, man. Stuff and nonsense. Stuff and nonsense. Save your strength, Magnus. We'll take care of this. I'll take care of you. Jesse. Magnus. My armor. 
It looks great on you, man. I want you to keep it, okay? It's not gonna be much use to me anymore. Don't say such things. Magnus, no. This armor belongs to you. You earned it, Jesse. Hey, at least I finally got to be a real hero, right? <sighs> All those people, they're alive. The Witherstorm didn't kill them. Jesse, you gotta help them. All of them. Make sure they get out. Don't leave anybody behind. Swear, okay? I'm not going anywhere. Not without. Come on, Reuben. We've got a job to do. You guys help the survivors. I need to make sure we find the people who might be trapped. Get to safety. There are people over there who can help you. Thank you. Thank you. We're gonna be okay. I promise. I... Thank you. Don't worry, it's all over now. My friends are gonna help you. I hope you're right. Thank you. No! The command block, that's impossible! I, I don't understand. Soren said the Formidabomb would destroy it, but it, it, it looks fine. What the? Guys! Over here! No! No! Somebody help! Can't hold on! But I thought you were dead! I saw you! What's happened to you? I'll explain everything, just not right now! Next time on Minecraft Story Mode. Faced with a devastating defeat, our heroes will have to search deep within themselves in order to rise above tragedy, Ugh. heal broken friendships, untangle bitter rivalries, and find the strength to make one last stand against the storm.
seem scary, but he's a swell guy. Sally dilly dallies, give her credit, she tries. They might look the same to the untrained eye, but that's a lie. So I say, I can't say it. I haven't had luck with humans. They can be so unkind. But lend a hand to an ender man. Soon you'll find you have a friender man. As long as you never look them in the eye, you'll never have to say, Oh, this is proving difficult. What's the end if not a new beginning? Sunset precedes sunrise And so I say with tears in my eyes Farewell What is it? Oh, the singing or the dancing? Oh, it's both, isn't it? <laughs>